Each week, we'll highlight famous Glaswegians throughout history. Today, it's Winnie Drinkwater. One Winnie Drinkwater, who lived in Cardonald, made aviation history in 1930 by becoming the youngest aircraft pilot in the world. She was just 17 when she qualified under the instruction of Captain John Houston at the Scottish Flying School in Renfrew. Two, she was the daughter of a mechanical engineer and a district nurse. Winnie spent two years taking part in air pageants and races, winning cups even before she was old enough to hold her full license. By her 21st birthday she was not just the youngest commercial pilot in Britain but also a ground engineer. Three piloting twin-engine dragons, she became the first woman pilot in the UK to fly the inaugural Glasgow to London service. In 1932, she won the Scottish Flying Club trophy for landing and in October of that same year, won one of the club's cups for air racing, winning by just two seconds over a course of 15 miles. Four her charter work included press assignments and newspaper deliveries to isolated corners of Scotland, including Campbelltown and Isla, as well as Belfast and the Isle of Man. Along with ambulance work on the Western Isles, her duties included making an air search for a boat full of kidnappers, and flying press photographers up and down Loch Ness in search of Nessie. 5. She was married to Francis Short, the director of Short Brothers Aeroplane Manufacturers. The couple's wedding took place in Dumfries on 19 July 1934 and it was covered by numerous national newspapers. Although she rarely flew after having her two children, she was registered with the flying section of the Women's Legion, a forerunner of the Air Transport Auxiliary. There is a commemorative sculpture of Winnie and the Clyde View Park in Renfrew. For more on this story, visit the news article link.